So there it all is, the whole lot. I'll just show you around a little bit. So first aid kit always on the belt, with the belt pack, the little down jacket we talked about before with its uh, dry bag in case of very inclement weather. Thermarest New Air ladies size. Awesome, my summer sleeping bag. Really is tiny. Look at the size of my foot. That thing is tiny. <laughs> In its dry bag, very important. All warm clothes, a uh, little personal affairs, my scribbling book and head torch and stuff like that. My Z rest. Trekking pole, of course, important. Mountain laurel designs. Excellent ultralight sleeping bag. My Brit military bivy bag, which also um, is the backrest for my um, backpack here because it has not got a backrest. Then we've got Solar, so a Goal Zero Nomad plus my Monster uh, uh, waterproof, everything proof uh, solar pack there. I've got some wood tools, my satellite communications device, that awesome little steamer thing, Kuxa, my uh, usual uh, titanium canteen, the map and my crampons and stuff like that. Then the uh, cook, fat, uh, cook pack that we talked about, the little hammock, poncho, monster food bag, and my gloves for the day. So, um, but and it looks like a lot, but really it's kind of what you need in end of October in this kind of terrain if you're going to be fully autark fully autonomous you need to really be looking what you're doing so yes that is how it works so i'm going to pack all that into the bag now and see what else we're going to do today